seems to be supporting lungs. Yes, this is the largest muscle of the body. It supports lungs. When it goes up, lungs contract and we breathe out. When it goes down, we breathe in and lungs expand. What are these trees, branches? There are 60,000 tubes and lungs. Oh, these are bronchioles. These are small tubes which takes air inside and out of the body. There are 30,000 in each lung. Uh, uh, 60,000 bronchioles! What are these small, small balls? Oh, you can see them. We can see them because of magic. These are called alveoli. From here, oxygen goes to the blood and carbon dioxide comes in from blood to lungs. So, this is exchange point of gases. Carbon dioxide comes in from the blood and oxygen goes to the blood. In this way, oxygen is spread through the whole body. Alloy exchange center for carbon dioxide and oxygen. Oh, now I understand the whole process. Let me show you something. What is this for? Oh, let me show you an experiment. How our diaphragm and lungs work. Okay. This rubber is like a diaphragm and balloon is like the lungs. When the diaphragm goes down, air goes into the lungs. And when your diaphragm goes up, air goes out of lungs. Oh now, I know how we breathe. Here is some more on breathing. Do you know from where does the fish get oxygen to breathe? No. They must come out. No, they don't need to come out. There is a lot of oxygen mixed in the water. Fishes take oxygen from the water. Oh, but I have heard that fishes don't have lungs. Yes, you're right. They breathe from the gills in their body. Eh, eh. Fish don't have lungs. They breathe through gills. Let me note it down. Nose, trachea, lungs, bronchioles, diaphragm and alveoli. <laughs>